Jake my uh, screen to my game yet. Look at that. You don't normally see that. <laughs> I've only done this ahead of time. There we go. I forgot I had a, a little fight with Steam just before <laughs> I went live. I sang it quite the interesting song. Because <laughs> it doesn't always remember my Steam sharing. It doesn't always remember my Steam sharing. And it's very annoying when I'm trying to play a game and it forgets. I'm gonna do some sign ins and ah, pain. <laughs> I'll be good. Gotta go now. I don't remember where we are. It's been, it's been like a week <laughs> or something, maybe even longer. Yeah, maybe longer. Well, I took a little while over Christmas and everything. Yeah. It feels like it's been a while since I looked at this. Okay, so what are we doing? We need one more stone by two days' time. We can do that. I remember water was an issue, and it looks like it still is. We're in the beginning of our day. Mm, how do we look on food? Oh, we've got a couple of fishes. <laughs> Lots of arrows, though. Okay. Okay. What are we crafting? Uh, nothing. Okay, good. How are people looking? Okay, okay. We'll probably deal with some... Depression. What should we do with that first, or do we do with that second? As if you want food. Ooh, five roll meat and our trap back. Nice. So that's another four fish. That's six food that we have just sitting around. The people aren't particularly hungry, are they? Not super hungry. It's really nice to have a meal for everyone. Yeah, okay, we could have Irix out of um, fishing this morning. Have you hang out in the tavern? Do we have this? Biz we have. Oh, we got biz. Actually, let's check that everything is uh, repaired. Make sure nothing's slipping by on a good, good. And uh, what's our. That's right, because we're having issues with our lumber camp being uh, overused. But wood is really important, so I was trying to minimise lumber camp use. Camp, hunt camp, both good to go. Mining camp is fine. We could do the rest, but we need the, the stone. Okay, that's good to know. Oh yeah, we have a garden now as well. How's that going? Hmm, it's dry. <laughs> that's fair. We look like we're quite dry. What's our wood? I think I need a little bit more than that. <laughs> it's actually, we're gonna cook some food. Okay. All right, I see the situation. So. Who has an excise suppression? That would be you. Alright, you guys hang out, have a drink together. We're gonna need to craft something. What do we need? Mmm, we're gonna craft some more traps. Craft some more traps? There's traps here. Mm, what do we need? We need more wood. Okay, that's fair. Can I make anything good? That takes water. It all takes water to make the good potions. We should wait until we have more water. Okay, so we do want to craft something over here on the workshop. What have we got? What are our options? Better fatigue recovery at night. It's good. I like the sound of that. Uh, less fatigue for exploring. Exploring doesn't really wipe us out. Uh, boiling water consumes less fire. Handy. Not urgent. Better uh, fatigue Recovery oh, from the rest area. I was like, from the workshop? <laughs> from the rest area. It makes the rest area more effective. Again, uses fabric and pelts. Uh, fresh fruit turns into more water. Less fatigue and harvesting fruit. We don't really harvest fruit that much. Cooking lowers fire intensity only by 3 to 8%. Like, for, for all the meals or per meal? I assume that's per meal. Instead of, like, 3% for cooking like 10 meals. <laughs> The salt. Oh, that one's pretty tempting. That's iron and bone. What have we got here? Less injuries while hunting. Better traps is good. And these we need more wood for. Hmm. Not losing as many traps would be good. Do 
do like this though. The iron and the bone were really myths as well. Yeah, let's make the cooking better then. That'll be our crafting. Okay, so let's focus on who needs to do what. You're gonna bear the water. Dog. Uh, does Kari have a buff right now? Does everyone have a buff? Or our dog buffs. There's so many buffs. Um, your dog is better. Yeah, you got you got the dog buff. Do you have guard dog? Battle dog. Battle dog for one day. Oh. Let's have you carry on resting. We'll go up for a random special item. You're obviously not going to stay there. Um, so what do we need? We need a bit more wood. And we do mining. Exploration is good, we have enough water. So who do we have? We have Moira, Lenore, uh, Lady Tomway, and our two monks. No, one monk. Only this monk. Then we want a little bit of food. We could have Lenore go hunting. He's good at that. We need to carry on mining because we need that tiny bit more stuff but we have two days to get that stone and that would leave him without anything to do but he gets super exhausted from physical activities so let's yeah move Lady Tom away to there let's get our wood just to burn our fire because we need to be careful with our wood because that resource is running low we do that yeah well you can just leave him in the herb list he doesn't need like a rest does he not right now maybe we'll bring the rest of the people in the tavern so fine. Everyone's doing something useful. Okay, I think this is where we start. Where I can carry on her, her crafting. Gonna have a nice drink together. Eric never gets as much out of this as I want him to. Excited. Drunk. <laughs> Not excited. Bunch of water. Pretty good amount of water. And back pain, naturally. Can't do anything without consequence. <laughs> I think we're growing hemp right now in the garden, actually. I don't think we're growing vegetables. I think we. I guess we need rook for something. Not sure what. <laughs> Ooh, nice hunting point. Ah, that's plenty of meat. Okay. Oh, good on food. We probably even feed the dogs some food. Mm, maybe. Oh, okay. She needs to have her injury treated. Okay, there's some resting to be done. Let's see what do we find. Okay, we checked out some forest. Something's damaged as well. Dirty. And... Scouting! And encounter! I was like, oh, maybe the scouting will do it. <laughs> it will get her through. Mm, she's also a little bit scary to take into combat right now because of her um, injury. So I might instead take Blue Duet, as much health, and him. He has a bunch of like, decreases right now. He has the looter, which I like, but they're better off taking like someone with more health. Yeah, okay, let's go for this combo. We haven't had the three out for a fight. Hey, headbat! Thank you! Thank you for the headbat! <laughs> I'm thinking hard about combat strategies. <laughs> Berserkers and a shield maiden. Good fight. No, I think we go for the shield maiden first. Before she can start giving buffs and protecting. We do, do the most damage to her for whatever reason, so go for it. Go for it, Kari. Get your dodge up by 40%. Save your point. Eric okay, can step himself forward and directly into harm's way, but that's just how it's gonna be. I can do a shout first and buff everyone. Become center of attention. Go. We're doing quite a good bit of damage. 
Well, it still has like a good a good chance to do damage. Nice. Now these guys can knock us back. I remember that they love to to knock back. And of course, why not crit for all of my shield? Why wouldn't you? <laughs> oh, a large wing hits everyone. Misses everyone. Even better. And yeah, shield bending can only sort of buff and defend. But working her down early is very nice. Um, been a while, Blue Red. You can buff and hit. Okay, so you can't like target everyone with anything. I'm also pretty sure you never step forward with any of your moves. What does this give? AP minus one, damage resistance plus one on self. Mm, let's dodge this accuracy for the target to the front. Okay. Oh, that's not that. Wait, this one. <laughs> Zero to two. One to two. Okay, you know, let's this back around a little bit. There you go. You're a debuff. You're zero to two, so you have like no chance. But you can give a buff to Eric. We will be stepping forward shortly. Okay, because we don't have we don't have our row separated, we can't hit everyone with that AoE. We can wipe one person out and Mm, you have a really, really high crit chance. You know what? Take the second <laughs> shot. <laughs> oh, of course. <laughs> Nearly 50% crit chance and you do minimum damage. Why not? <laughs> Alright, Eric, give everyone the buff. Step forward. Go for the same one. I assume he's the, the weakest to damage. Um, You can smack him again for two. There we go. All right, so now he's got he's got a dodge stunts and he's got damage resistance, I believe. They should take less damage. <laughs> he might even dodge. Yeah, it's working. It's working. He's still not back. That's okay. You head smacking. Take away his AP, and more importantly, just put him down to three. Give Iron buff back. Because he a damage he takes is now into his injury. Oh, I'll swing! Come on, everyone! <laughs> oh, no one dodged. It's okay. Blue has a butt ton of shield. That's awesome. Hey, okay, you take out that one. This Kari is the best. Get your dodge on. Nice. Okay, you give everyone a buff. And step forward. Create two rows. And we have two rows for more than one second. Or are you immediately going to knock me back again? And do damage. Amazing. We do well we can insult him make him less likely to uh dodge and then we can just just smack him we're going for the kill and insult him gonna beat him up uh you could do two sniper shots with no debuff okay come on do better thank you perfect there you go she was just planning it she knew she had two hits she can spread it out Okay, good. No actual. Ah, oh, dang it. I was like, no actual wounds. Okay, he's got broken jaw, so he's gonna go to the tent. Not Shinor. Or I'll use that badge on Blue to Wed. Oops, run on one of me. Your stomach screams in pain. Here, take this. Food? Where did you get this? Shh. Not so loud. I found some today. It's yours. Just remember who your true friend is in this camp. Hey, hunger. Nice. And she is the cook. It's only fair to, to feed her, I guess. Ah, fix that with a piece of wood. What did we find? Is it plot? Is it part of the plot? We've got fruit and leaf. 
a heap of leaves are on the ground for further inspection. You realise they're not just some leaves, they are medicinal herbs, and it's not all among the leaves. You can also distinguish some orangey fruits. That's a very nice loot. Uh, let's check the leaves before we take the fruit. There's some intelligence. This heap of leaves intrigues you. It's strange that it was left here, right in the middle of the forest. No one would be foolish enough to abandon such a loot. Nah, no, not really. No, really, you think this is too shady. Pick up a branch long enough to interact with the leaves without having to come too close, then you hit the heap. Nothing happens, it's reassuring. However, you push a fruit that disappears through the leaves before a muffled noise is heard a few seconds later. It surprises you, so you start again with another fruit. You hit the noise again. You understand there's something down below. How you move? Is it, is it a young girl? <laughs> We're looking for one of those. You remove carefully some leaves to see what's underneath, and you make a surprising and boring discovery under the heap of leaves. Actually held by a small wooden structure, the deep hole that seems to be wonderfully hidden. Obviously, it's a trap. Okay. We can use the trap with our stealth, with our surprisingly stealthy unit. If it's a trap, you might as well use it to your advantage. Might as well using it. <laughs> You may manage to catch an animal with it and bring some food to the camp. You position yourself a little further, making sure you have the trap in your sights. And so now we have to wait for an animal to come. Wait silently. Just wait silently. Easy. Your patience and your discretion finally pay off. A few minutes later, there's an animal coming. It's a young deer attracted by the fruit. It sniffs the air and looks around it to spot any hostile presence. By chance, it doesn't spot you, and judging it's safe, comes close to the trap, unaware of what's going to happen. What's a deer fall into the hole, so you stand up to go to the trap. The animal winded is stunned, dimly moves at the bottom of the hole. The bottom's hole? <laughs> you catch it by a leg and drag it outside. And then you kill it, gently. Gently. Finally, you cut it up and take some meat. That will be a great meal tonight. Okay. Oh, eight roll meat. That is a great meal. And it's venison. Yeah, I know. Hey, and cola nuts. Three nuts. It was in the deer. Uh, we could also just on the trap while we're here, I guess. Hmm, that sort of takes a lot of things. Um, our highest stat here is courage. <laughs> so let's assume you pick one of them and you don't have to pass all three. <laughs> the trap structure is very simple. You can easily undo it with your bare hands and get the leaves and the fruit that are on it. However, you're going to have to be careful that you don't fall into hop. Well, in the hole, yeah. Uh, you decide to undo the trap before you lose birds of the hole. Ouch, it was a hard fall, you hurt everywhere. You, glad you hardly get back on your feet and look around you. Okay, that's yeah, that was quite a fall. You're in quite a deep hole and a few bones you find the ground prove that you're not the first to fall in this hole. You need to get out of here quickly, otherwise it'll be you that will be covering the ground soon. Okay, you sad? You sad about this? Uh, climate, you're not going to do that, but you are courageous. <laughs> you don't have many other skills, but you are courageous. Try to climb the wall, but the soil crumbles in your hands, preventing you from climbing higher just by your many tries. You can't get out like this. You curse stuff for your recklessness. If you were more careful, this never would have happened. You yell, you scream, call for help, hoping for someone to hear you. But no one's coming. A few hours later, you abandon all hope. You realise you're, <laughs> you're probably never coming out of this hole alive. Desperate. You cry your eyes out. Okay? He's just sobbing in there now. My later, the night is almost fallen. You hear some noise and you raise your head. Above, you can see some people from the camp that came looking for you. They get out to help you thanks to some ropes. If they're still listless, your eyes are red and swollen. Uh, the trip back to Canada decides not only to talk, it's going to be set to say, I'm so traumatised by what you've been through. But when does the courage come into it? <laughs> traumatised for six days. Ah, the courage didn't even come up. Tell her that was the least important stat. <laughs> least important of all of them. Any of the others would have been better. Alright, fine. Um, let's use our bandage on someone. I think it's gonna be because you're gonna get healed. Uh, I don't really care about the crush fingers. Yeah, let's just deal with the back pain. Oh well, never mind. <laughs> uh, I'm going to stick a piece of wood on this fire. Probably more than one if I had to guess. Um, what can we make? We can make. Oh, tomatoes. I was like, wait, we can make soup out of just water. <laughs> Eight meat. I take sixty-four fire. Or up to sixty-four fire. There you go. Uh, dog, what can you do? Yeah, find a special item. Thanks. Uh, you could probably be fed. 
see this? Yeah. Mm. The 20? It needs to be at 20 to get those benefits. There you go, buddy. There we go, we've got those enabled again. Okay. There we are, we're friends with the dog once more. Alright, let's grab you. You do some healing on Iric, I believe it was. Yeah. Uh, heal wounds, yeah. You work on that. Someone needs to rest, and that person is... Eustache. There you go. Couldn't grab him for a sec. Um, leave more there. Well, that's not even near where my mouse was. Because <laughs> she has got quite good scavenging, so she can carry on getting some more water. I would really like to water the garden a bit. You know what? Let's just do it. There you go. We we'll use two water, get it a bit higher. Um, woodwork probably isn't as important as mining right now. And of course, exploring is always important. Is everyone doing something? Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's fine. Do it. Make it so. Nice, level up. I think we didn't really go down that much, but at least his jaw's not broken anymore. We rubbed a herb on that. Fixed. All better. That rest area gives us a pretty good rest now. Always getting better at crafting. My fingers uncrushed as of yet. Hey, still uncrushed. Yeah, a bit of water. Strong. But not as good as Bluewood. Got fertilizer, that makes better gardening. Oh, we've got three tasty meats. And five roasted ones. Nice, no waste. And only 33 fire. Nice, we can keep our piece of wood. Our natural resources are running low. We could do with uh, collecting as much stone as possible still before we need to uh, give our tributes so we can try and get some uh, Bjorn favour. He doesn't like us right now. We're not friends. Another encounter. Great. That's what I wanted. Ideal. Mm -hmm. You have less injuries, but you just like muddle people up. You don't really help that much. I, I like the blue to red buffs. Nor has too much damage on her still. So looking for people with buffs really but initiative of four is just so bad. It's gonna have to be Irik again. Just don't get beaten up this time. My dude. Okay we're all in the front line this time. Uh, that's easier for me to, to separate out <laughs> into two two bits. Um, did we just go on this guy? I think so. I wanted to get the dodge up, but critting was way better. <laughs> um, <laughs> I didn't want to waste... Uh, I, I've only wasted one AP because I would have been able to focus one, but... I didn't want to waste that one. Two to six. One to ten. One to ten is pretty pretty great. It's only seventy three percent chance. So two to six is also pretty great. This gives you a debuff, less dodge. So yeah, this nice guy is pretty annoying. So let's try and take him out. It's a little bit slow, which is frustrating because she has our buffs. It'd be nice for her to go faster. Fine, I'd rather him get knocked back because she has more shield and he can step forward more easily. 
You can take a few hits, it's fine, before taking any injuries. Um, you are going to... Do two to three, yeah, with a, with a debuff. Ah, unlucky. And get pirate your buff. Because he's already in a state where he'll take an injury next time he gets hit. Proud. Oh, you could do one to five, or you could do two to four. That's pretty great. Mm, unlucky. Get your forty percent dodge. Alright, Eric. Um, yeah, give, I'd rather give Kari the buff. She does more damage. Much more reliable on the hits than anyone else. Step forward and smack. Oh, you pitch him back. <laughs> I didn't expect that. That's handy because he'll have to waste something uh, coming forward. Good, good. It's way down, I'd prefer that. It's her getting hit and him not. That's bad. That was a rough one. Give him some more dodge. And do your three year attack. What's this one? Oh, that's the strep guard. Yeah. Mm. Which might also be good. Rather than just giving the buff, giving the, the full guard. Mm. You can finish him. Yeah, Kari's got the bloodthirst. <laughs> Bloodlust. She knows what's up. Do your yell. The yell is more so he can hit stuff. <laughs> like, his accuracy is really bad until he does his rah rah. 1083. Is 6. Mm. 22%. I didn't take your message. That sounds like me. 17. Pow. What did you say? I mean, I was at work and then I was away from my computer, so... <laughs> oh, no. as, I, as I've said <laughs> before, it's usually how my, my weekday goes. So I work all day and then I go away from my computer and then I come back for video games in the evening. Uh, okay, she's not in the front line, so she can't do her guarding one. She can do her buffing one, though. Uh, then she can step back forward. Uh, yeah, step back forward. Why not? You, you can do more from the melee line. Even though you've taken injury, too. There we go. Nice, nice. Great to deal with things. <laughs> Black eye. Okay. Ah, it affects the scavenging. That's annoying. <laughs> he needs to go back to the medical tent. For goodness sake. Uh, okay, what have we got? We've got a stone that needs to be used there, annoyingly. A cloth. And a cloth. What did we find? Come on, plot. Oh, we found uh, people we can have stay at our shelter. Unfortunately, we uh, don't have the space for them. Okay, we need to convert some water. We've got two for fire. How much um, fire do we need tonight? You have to bed. Good night, Eski. Have a good sleep. We got minus thirty. Oh, stretch and a hydrate. I'm gonna do them in the opposite order. There's my hydrate. And yeah, big stretch. Two part stretch. <laughs> okay, a bit more water. Fire. Fire. Convert water to 30. Okay, that's probably the most water I can convert and still keep enough guaranteed fire. Okay, dangerous. Oh, I have a uh, special item. Gardening. We'll probably give that to our real monk. This one. Angelica. End of the day. I think everyone's good. I don't think everyone's gonna suddenly die. Our daughter and I argued again today. 
That girl, it seems she just wants to do the contrary of whatever I say. Not buds. She wants to explore all day long. It's her only purpose in life, it seems. It's incredibly useful for us. <laughs> but she doesn't understand how dangerous it is outside of the camp, even though she's been in every single one of our fights and <laughs> until now. Anything could happen. Like a fight. And mostly the worst. Like a fight. <laughs> but she wins. Have you seen those crits? My goodness. Uh, Gavin's like, she's, she's really helping us. She's stronger than you think, you know. Yeah. Have you seen her crits? We can't overprotect her. Not anymore. Thanks for the support, Myrick. I'm sure that if you keep this attitude, you'll never listen to me. But I know best. Okay. <laughs> okay, we've got more than 60 hydrations. So close, though. Let's do 0.7 for everyone. Um, and then keep 0.7, that's fine. Won't bother turning like a couple of them into ones. Just that's fine. Everyone has a pretty high chance of getting rid of their dehydration. And yet two kept their dehydration. Even they had a 75% chance. <sighs> Okay, who needs the tasty ones? People who are the hungriest, such as you. And you. And you. And the less hungry people. Get the less good food. I think everyone gets something to eat. Uh, I don't know if Carrie's already had one, but she. <laughs> Her hunger's higher than Budweb's because she had a snack earlier, so there we go. That's fine, hopefully we don't lose too much of our leftover meat. But we might not need to do any sort of hunting tomorrow, which leaves more people to do other things. Such as healing <laughs> and being healed. Oh, everyone's going to lose their battle dog. Which means that's Valor's next job is to give everyone a new battle dog. Ah, chronic disease, good. <laughs> it's uh, useful. <laughs> I do think Mora is better at healing than Angelica, but Angelica gets like less sad about it. Three meat. Eh. Annoying, but okay. Yay! <laughs> rain! Alright, it's a storm, but that's fine. I'm happy enough. Always happy to see the rain. Uh, and we have enough water to explore. Alright, nice. So, how much food do I have? Oh, actually, let's go check our traps first. Okay, nothing bit. How's our garden? Um, not ready to harvest. Alright. How much food do we have? We have six meat and one fish. It's fine. I could have someone do some hunting. Alright, yeah, you do that again. <laughs> Does anyone need to rest particularly? Uh, let you tell me what you could do with it. You do with the sleep. We don't need to gather water. Someone who's better at crafting? Like, is Blue Dwarf better at crafting? Yeah, we can do that. Moira can. Moira can do the healing then. Yeah, you're better. You can do this bout of healing. Brother Angelico has a level I forgot about. I don't really care about giving him battle stuff. Better hunger, but less strength. Uh, better hunger, but less injury. I don't really get injured too much. Higher stealth, worse sickness. Was intelligence higher or wisdom? Mm, he is a wisdom character, he doesn't need intelligence. Mm. He has, yeah, he's frail and sickly, so he's bad for sickness and injury. Well, he is already bad for injury. I think he'd be better at hunger. Yeah, that's fine. False hunger recovery. 
stay okay. All right, I'm gonna gather some herbs. And then, yeah, you mining, that sounds like a good plan actually. No, not gonna hunt, but you could fish. You could probably do with a couple more fish. We've got plenty of bait. Enjoy. So who's where? Expedition, healing, workshop, healing, fishing. Rest mining herbalist. Yeah. That's everyone somewhere. Mm, we are going to need wood. if I need wood this round more than I need fish. Oh, we're going to need wood to cook with. So yeah, we're going to need wood more than fish. Not going to be able to get very much wood. We can't go too hard on the wood. Do we need stone as well? That's probably what we do then. Bruises. That wasn't really my priority, but that's fine. Yeah, she gets a bigger depression gain from it. Well, Angelica is pretty optimistic. We go got a cooking pot upgrade. We can see, we can see how that upgrades things. Okay, gotta fix our workshop. And get a bunch of water. Oh, it's like filled up potable water. Nice. Didn't even look at the dog. Didn't even look at how he was. Okay, a little bit of wood. See, that's enough to keep us going. So rubbish you get the stone so slowly. Hello. Okay, nice snow counter. Is there a plot here? There's a horse. No, oh, you see a giant dark horse. It's very agitated and knocks the fumes steam from his nostrils. There's an ominous aura in the air, the horse seems malevolent, unreal. For food? Brother Angelica, you don't have anything too bad going on with you. You keep a safe distance from the wild beast, its gruesome whining makes you shiver. Uh, I don't have an apple, I'm not going to throw crap at it, that's mean. <laughs> Give it a meat? Reconsider! We'll come back for you. I'll, I'll give you a, an apple. I need to, to make one. <laughs> uh, use a bunch of stone. Repair things. And a wood to repair things. Ah, that's pain. Alright, food. I want to make all of this. Uh, 42. That's not bad. Both of our wood, though, so we're gonna need more of that. Dog. You need a crappy on you. There you go, buddy. And carry on resting. Uh, who needs to be healed next? No. There you go. No one needs to rest, I think. The crafting plan. We need wood for a lot of things, but we can make our shelter a little bit better. That one's pretty good. Uh, yeah, that's probably the best thing we can do. <laughs> so, who do I know? I need you to cook. along to here, get a fruit, 
for the horse. I leave no one crafting, but we need a little bit of wood more than we need to craft. And to try and build up a stone. Yeah, that's probably the best. Oh no, wait, Lady Tumway, we have you. Yeah, so Lady Tumway do the forestry then. the crafting because he's our best crafter and he's a little bit tired so <laughs> this doesn't take up too much um fatigue yeah there we go everyone's got a job now oh, we could use this time as well to make potions could have thought of that should have making potions in the forge while it's raining because we have a surplus of water First, we'll make pillars. Pillars are important. Mm, okay, our water got damaged. Always a pain. But I'd rather it be storming than not raining. Raining really, really helps. <laughs> it's really useful. Oh, you're gonna waste some meat? Oh no, you may taste one, it's okay. You're not just reading your book there. Make sure you're gathering some fruit. Okay, good job. We just needed the one fruit, so that's fine. Proving all the time. But he is tuckered, my goodness. Incredibly tuckered. I have to uh, make sure uh, we don't get uh, fatigue gains from this storm. Otherwise, he will possibly die. <laughs> expect him to get that tired. Okay, she's being lucky. Nearly maxed out on exploration. Only we could find some areas relating to the plot. There's like a child we need to find and other people we need to find. Ah, uh, we can have Lady Tamaway in the fight. And Blue Red's, Blue Red's still pretty great. Oh no, wait, Shinor's back. Yeah, that's right, I healed her. <laughs> He's feeling a lot better. Oh, my audio suddenly dipped. <laughs> um, no, let's have Blue Red as our like tank. Yeah. Alright, of course, why wouldn't it put my two archers at the front? Why not? Okay, hit and move back. Everyone get back. Get your dodge on. This is the exact opposite that <laughs> I'd like the party. Um, have we go for in for another hit? I think so. Get some damage in there. No one's managed it yet. Mm, bad dodge. Alright, that one's got the buff. Still deal with the uh, shield rain first, which is a pain. He'll defend whoever's on the lowest HP. Okay, good, they're not all going to attack the same of course, misses a person that has tons, tons of HP. <laughs> Alright, I need you to step forward. I'm just gonna have you step. And then. Any other A row? You don't have anything that just targets a row, do you? So you can do that. You can guard and you get damage resist. Yeah, go ahead and guard Kari. Since he's in 
like injury territory there. You can save your AP for next time. Alright, carry you don't have to worry about dodge. Get in there. Do some damage. <laughs> That's not really what I was going for. And you still have to do your dodge. That's because of the amount of uh, AP I end up with. <laughs> Alright, Chanel, you can do it. I think you can just hit everyone. Yeah. That probably works better. Now she has no dodge. <laughs> Sorry, has dodge. <laughs> and guard. A blue red will at least take less damage <laughs> than anyone else would. Damage resist. Unfortunately, the two archers are kind of letting us down. <laughs> they haven't been doing their work. Alright, she's, she's now into injury territory. Okay, let's... Okay, you, you, you do some damage. Put some back around. There you go. Do it again. Kill her. There you go. A little finishing finishing touch there. Um, do you probably best. Nice hit them both. Definitely means it's best. You can hit from one to five there, you can hit from two to four. No, I think going for the potential kill over here is what would do it. Unfortunate, but you have a second shot. Make it count. Thank you. One left. That could pull up forward. Nope, doesn't. Okay. <laughs> okay, does it? He has range hits. <laughs> Good. Why not? Why wouldn't you? Get smacked in the face with a shield. That's what you get for having ranged attacks. You get smacked in the face with a shield. See when that got you. <laughs> Um, you can't hit twice, so you may as well debuff. Of course, he resists. Why wouldn't he resist? What? What's going on with you, Kari? What's... <laughs> you used to deal with better damage than that. What's happening? Learn, learn yourself down. And everyone else, as a result. How are all getting? Really, we need Shinor to like take this one, or like anyone to dodge ever. That'd be cool too. There you go. Hopefully, these wounds aren't too bad. Broken ribs. All right. One stone. One stone. All important stone. Uh, water needs to be fixed. That takes wood. Uh, check out our new lake. Reflections in the water. A faint sparkle of light catches your eye on the surface of the water. Sun rays shine gently from between the clouds. You notice a glowing circular reflection where the rays meet the water. It's too regular to be natural. Even if the undulation of the water makes it hard to read, it reminds you of the shape of a rune. Okay, we got a rune. Let's uh, examine it with uh, Moira's wisdom. You know in your heart that this is a well-known room with some kind of universal power. I'll try to remember. There we go. Good, good. Finally got a lucky roll. Of course, it is so low. The mark of the sun. Something everyone worships every day, no matter who their gods are. It's the room of, room of guidance, success, honor, and fire. Okay, extra wise. Being a wise. Throw a stone. Throw a stone at the water. That sounds good. See, what's this roll actually? Seems like this is gonna be a tricky one. Pick up a nearby stone and aim at the mirror reflection. Not to fly. Okay, good. That's two seventies in a row. It's the luckiest we've ever been. As the stone falls in the middle of the chain circle and splatters it with, shatters it with a splash of water. When clouds briefly hide the sun, and you feel a deep sadness. 
What were you thinking? No doubt you had to prove your mood by trying to negate symbols of light. Uh, you're right, get in that water. Get in there. Um, I think maybe Tomway. The best chance of everything there. And has a high roll on courage. Which last time didn't have to be particularly useful, but... <laughs> You put your feet in the water and start walking. When it goes above your waist, you have no choice but to start swimming to get closer to your objective. Swim. Nice. Lucky. You're getting closer, but after a while, you suspect the sun rays have their own will and are trying to stay out of your reach. The circle of light keeps moving as you do. It's almost within your arm's reach. Oh, how good. You have high agility. I get you. Ah, oh, can't be lucky forever. Extend your arm as far as you can and swim frantically for a few seconds to increase your speed. To no avail. Oh, so tired. Give up. Come back. You're too tired. Um, does anyone else have a good chance of doing this? I'm about to go to bed, so like it's uh, a fine time to try. So we know the constitution is for swimming, so that's pretty important. He has pretty even rolls on all of them. Okay. Two. Okay, check one. And then. Let's try and catch it again. Failed a second 70. <laughs> Sadly, you play that training circle light doesn't make it close when you just like turn back. Mm. Right, give up. You're too tired? Okay. We'll come back. <laughs> uh, we need fire. Oh, and check if we gain fatigue. We do. So we need to give uh, you stash something to keep him alive. We have. Get yeah, read. <laughs> that won't help, but. <laughs> We could at least die happy. Um, we've got cola nuts. We've got less depression, less sickness. Less sickness, more hunger. Actually, let's change to like first aid so we can just see what we're after here. Depression. States. I think cola nuts are standing out to me. I'm just making sure that I made better. All states is good, but it's better made into a potion. I can do minus 20 all states. So we'll use the cola nuts. We need 88. How much can we gain? Up to 15. Okay. Up to 15. Let's make sure everyone can take 15. 15 away from. It is 85. Get one more going up. There you go. All right, and then we need how much fire? Uh, 55. If we have max decreases. Oh, let's do one over 55 just in case. It's <laughs> a little bit risky. All right. We're giving the dogs some feet. I learned that you raided when you were young. Tell me about it, please, Dad. Mm. It was a job. Nothing more, nothing less. Mood killer, yeah, but it was exciting. No, less boring than plowing fields. Exciting, yes. Scary, hard, violent, depressing, unfulfilling, and shameful. After so much violence, you see life differently. You'll see. Dad, don't spoil me the end of the saga. Maybe I'll like it more than you. Aha, uh -huh. you'll make your own path to Valhalla, my daughter. I guess all the evil that men do there is goodness. I wouldn't have met your mother without Norsemen raiding our poor neighbours. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what do you mean? Your mother and Moira don't like to talk about it, but their village was raided when they were small children. Northmen came to the Welsh coast and burned everything. They were taking us captives since they were the children of the local Yarl. Wow, 
I didn't know that. Yes, back at our homeland there were rays like perfect north wind. Only their blazing hair would tell their Welsh heritage. There we go. Oh, he hit, he hit exactly a hundred! How'd he even hit a hundred? <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. I thought I brought him down enough. He took 22. He must have had um, minuses to his to his gains. <laughs> there you go. On day 62 after the exile, our beloved Eustache died of extreme fatigue. He couldn't sleep a night for days. Every move was hurting him. He didn't complain, but the daily tasks were too much for his body to bear. He suddenly fell down on his knees and passed out, his head hitting the ground with a bad gritty sound. The soul will face judgment at the gates of purgatory after his sins are cleansed by divine punishment. The soul may rest in heaven with the best. Amen. Now, uh, when the others found him dead, Harry smiled. Eric was a bit sad. Blue eyes shed a tear. More broke into tears. Then all smiled. Lady Tom always smiled. Brother Angelica was a bit sad. Lady Chuck was sitting down. Took seven naps. Relaxed four times. Seven. And fine three times. Ah, that's a chair. I liked uh, you, Stash. R.I.P. You were just too tuckered. Oh, you can go grab someone else. <laughs> he got some people uh, in the wings. <laughs> Barry needs to water. Look around the map, see who we have to uh, to pick up. We have a few people that are like in groups, which is no good. We need an individual. If there's one kicking around. Okay, eat that. Eat that. Work our way around to the other meals. There you go, the meal for everyone. <laughs> it worked out. Okay, let's make on my side. Hello, hello! <laughs> hello, how's it going? Good evening, good evening. You love computer games. You're a trophy hunter. Uh, me. I, uh, I, I do like computer games now. I used to. Just always start my games and never finish them, uh, and just like come back to them, forget everything that I'd done with them, and start them again. So I just like restart them over and over and over again. But now I've, I've been a lot better. I like decided I was going to start completing my games more, and just like rush mainline them, just to <laughs> enjoy the story and get them done. Try not to like go off on too many side quests, unless the side quests are really fun. <laughs> But once I get too sidetracked, that's often the end. <laughs> we sidetracked forever. Yeah, I go into to mainlining some games I had on my list for a while. <laughs> hey, you're gonna want some food, aren't you, dog? Ah, I've got to go back to the horse. That's okay, we can go back to the horse now. Ah, goodbye, Rain. It was good while it lasted. Oh, what got damaged? This. Yes. Alright, let's go to the horse now. Horse. They're slow gamers, they're competing even stand up games as they go I always get overwhelmed because I have like probably more like hours in my Steam library left to play than than like hours I have left to live. I <laughs> I'm pretty sure. <laughs> so so when I pick up a game it's like I'm gonna I'm gonna hit it, I'm gonna get through it. <laughs> and then move on to the next one. Yeah, just by every nook and cranny. That's good too, really getting into like the uh the world of the game. So I think it'd be nice to just have like two games, <laughs> you know. Instead of like a massive backlog. But then you could like really make the most of the ones you have. But I do have a million games. <laughs> uh, let's, um, let's have Brother and Delico deal with the horse. Give us a distance from the white boots to mix with some whining. Uh, you're going to have an apple. If you throw an apple at it, you know, have time to blink. The horse rushes on the fruit and swallows it. Uh, and it chews on the fruit a few times and gulps it with a disgusting sound. Alright, it's my friend now. You can try and tame it. We don't have anywhere to, like, put it, but <laughs> you're like, the most doubts and worried you're going to get killed, but <laughs> do your best. <laughs> Taming a wild beast like that would be an impressive feat, but you ponder your options. Uh, you have higher courage, and also it's bad to come from the back of a horse. Okay, good. So far so good. 
You advance towards the wild horse with confidence, so you try to show it who's the master. The beast is whining like a furious ghost, kicking out like crazy, but you don't flinch. You move in front of it. You raise your arm towards its head, but the demonic beast bites your hand. Oh no! Oh, it's still hungry. <laughs> Even though we gave it an apple. Uh, during the day, it came down quite well. Good. Got a couple to play, another couple to finish. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's good. Chunking through him. Uh, it's going to pay to see the evil in the eyes of the beast. You flee without delay. Give it another apple. More apples. Eat it. <laughs> Maybe it'll get full. Maybe it needs meat. <laughs> and then it won't like try and bite someone. Uh, your crap meals are back up to 20. That gives you all your buffs. Uh, you're all like already fully charged. But we should have Battle Dog. I don't need to gather more water right now. How's the garden? I should have had like a ton of water. Yeah, it's got plenty of water. What do people need? People are tuckered and sad. Hang on. Maybe we'll deal with depression first then. Moira and they will turn away. Have a drink. Oh, missed. You and you. Enjoy your beverage. Uh, you don't need to be there. We do need people to get food. Okay, nice. We've got both our traps back. We have three food. Oh, yeah. I need to find a new person. We have this lady. This dude. They're the only two on their own. Uh, let's take the... We have mostly dudes, I think, so let's say the lady. The old hag. Come with me, hag. Oh, but then we have... I feel like she's going to be a wisdom person. And we already have so much wisdom. Eh, come with me. <laughs> you got you got horns, I like that. I'm a fan of the antlers. And the crow on your... Yeah, come, come with me. Um, hello? Mm hmm... Mm. You must be dead, poor old woman. Ah! <laughs> I remember the giants of yore who gave me bread in the days gone by. Nine worlds I knew, the nine in the tree, with mighty roots beneath the mold. Hmm? <laughs> what? Uh, are you feeling well? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> glad, glad you're enjoying a holiday. <laughs> I'm doing my best. <laughs> Exploring my range of characters. <laughs> like an old woman lost alone in a forest, dumbass. <laughs> no, not that. It's just, well, I mean. Are you feeling well, child? Eating too many flies with your big open mouth like this? Must be buzzing in your head. <laughs> when you come back to your senses, maybe you'll feel obliged to propose to an old lady to join your camp. How do you? No. Ha! <laughs> yes. What? Nothing. Never mind. Come with me. I will let no lady starve in the woods. Come, we will protect you. We have a camp set up not far from here. Ah! Protect. You'll soon realise that you'll need my protection. Sure, sure. What's your name? Mm. 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 Okay, never mind. The old woman follows you to your camp with her help of a walk stick very, very slowly. Now part of your community, for better or for worse. Alright, we have gained one lady. There she is, new people. That's her name, new people. Crazy Volva. That's what she is. Uh, what's your what's your deal? A ton of wisdom, a ton of intelligence, a lot of stealth, a bit of healing, and harvesting and gardening. Cool. That's what I expected. I assume you're just a magic fighter. <laughs> okay, good. Uh, Mystic gear yeah, with the heal. I think you're the same as Moira. Yeah. 
Uh, so I'm not going to use it for combat, basically. Uh, you get a scavenging plus 10. I would like you to still keep your beast handling. Mr. Cooking, can you cook? You can cook. You know what, that's handy. Let's just give you the straight 10 to scavenging. What else have we got? Plus, plus 5, experience hunter. On the mountains. Ah! I'm not going to use you for forestry or mining. Yeah, you don't like either of the things. You probably get exhausted, I'm willing to bet. You do anything endurance related. Uh, endurance. Yeah, yeah, you're not going to like that. Do mm. you need your courage? What kind of high courage? Probably better injury resistance is better. You're going to be our main healer. Exploration plus 10. Uh, exploration plus 10. You're in the presence of the Deputy Samurai Lady. Yes, Lady Tomoe is still with us. <laughs> she is still with us. We did, we've did. we lost one so far. We lost Eustache, the, the French fake monk. Unfortunately, he got exhausted. He got exhausted to death. Very unfortunate. Minus concentration. Rage. Rage. Concentration. Concentr oh no, you don't want my sister to concentration. Mm. An AP plus one is good. I'm not. Oh, it's called body of mine. I could have worked out that wasn't going to be useful. <laughs> no, I'll just take the AP plus one. That's handy if you do ever end up in combat. Which hopefully you won't, but there you go. Well, straight wisdom plus ten. That will give you max out wisdom. Nice. Oh, uh, too smart. Makes you more depressed. I don't want you to be more depressed. Doing healing already makes you kind of depressed. Uh, talented is good. Oh, fast depression recovery is probably... Oh, minus five experience to uh, concentration, which is all you do. But less depressed. Mm, your traits. Too old to learn. Okay, so you already get less concentration and endurance skill XP gain. Okay, hate crafting. You're blind, worth exploration, you're clumsy, worth hunting. Okay. To your drug addict, that's a, pos that's a positive. <laughs> you get. Okay, you heal a bit of everything every night. Okay. Good. Um. Cool. <laughs> Sound, it seems like it might be alright then. Actually, if that's depression recovery, it seems like it's good too, because you're already getting minuses to your XP gain. Um, I don't want you to lose five wisdom, it just max it out. So instead, you will get a root. Agile doesn't really help because you probably have a lot of moves that only do one damage. You're not really gonna fight. Yeah, dumb brute's fine. Have worse effects resistance. Probably not going to be an issue. Better harvesting XP? That sounds like it's going to be the deal. Uh, yes. Yeah, yeah. Sure, so better at harvesting. Cool. Okay, good. Dog. Oh, that's right. <laughs> that's right. We're in the middle of um, assigning people. <laughs> that's what I was doing. All right. So you, I put you in the tavern already? I put you in the tavern already. You're having beers. Good. You're crafting. Good. Okay. These people are all in the right place. You are ready to do some healing. Who needs healing? Do we have enough people to do healing? Kari needs some healing actually before she goes out on her next exploration. That's probably the place for you. Mm, I could sort of do the rest, but he's not going to get too tired from that. Already checked our traps. Yes. How much do we have? How much we need? One. <laughs> okay. Yes, we need. We need some food. You know, could do some hunting. You will be exhausted. You want? You need to rest. You'll be exhausted if you do any uh, of this. <laughs> in the tavern. You're in the tavern. Okay, actually, you 
Let's chop some wood. That's a little bit of wood. Our resources are running low there. Chop some wood. Our tribute guy is coming. You mine some stone. Chop some wood. Mine some stone. Chop some wood. Mine some stone. Wood to wood. How much stone do you make? Everyone makes the same amount of stone. It doesn't matter how good they are. They all make the same amount of stone, which is like nothing. <laughs> Then you, instead of resting, you can do some crafting. That won't take you out too much. No one's exploring. That's fine. Got plenty of water. Yes, this is what we need. I love the antlers. They're so good. I would wear this. I would wear this hat. I didn't know she was injured. And <laughs> I don't know what you're trying to heal. But you failed. <laughs> you failed at it. Oh, broken ribs. That's right. She has broken ribs. Well, I'm making pillows. All right, he'll go. He'll go sleep next time. I think Tom might also need to sleep. There we go. They're feeling good. More of loving it. Sixty-three days. That they're, they're doing it. <laughs> Dion doesn't really like us. Um, <laughs> but we're doing it. I wish we could uh, find some plot. <laughs> the person that we're trying to find is... Well, there's several people that we're trying to find. Eventually we'll find them. We're gonna find the, the five fingers. And the missing daughter of one of them. <laughs> Alright, we have some tired people. We have enough wood to keep our fire going. Hey, everyone's so tired. They all just need to have a big nap. There we go, we've got our two, two stone above the tribute. That'll earn us some favour. <laughs> That'll fix everything. <laughs> Alright, the now familiar hoofbeat of Velox Mule can be heard in the distance. Here comes the human garbage again. Oh no! If we can make it quick this time. Hello, hello, my little piglet. Stream your time. And over here, precious resources to Uncle Ailoff. Here is your 20 stone. Here, yeah, we don't want any trouble. There you go. Wah! If you haven't understood yet that you're deep in it, you're dumber than I thought. <laughs> Thanks for your time. It's been a real pleasure, my little chicken. Next tribute for my master beyond. Praise be I name. 40 rope. But bye, my little ponies. Okay, cool. We didn't we didn't make a hassle because we only had twenty. Good. Okay, forty rope. That's a lot of rope. <laughs> that's, that's a lot of ropes. Uh, oh wait, you have a you have an upgrade. Do you have critical hits? Sickness resist. Uh, worst wisdom, better intelligence. Plus pressure recovery. Call of adventure. Critical hit for three is pretty good. I like fast and pressure recovery. I do have you do concentration skills though. Yeah, good hit for three. I'm using you as some combat. <laughs> Is Elof your favourite? <laughs> Is it your favourite character? <laughs> okay, we need some sleeps. Who needs to sleep the most? Uh, surprisingly, it's you, but my goodness, everyone's so exhausted. <laughs> um. Okay, if one of you needs some healing, that would be useful. Yeah, yeah. Irik could do with some healing. Are you injured? What's wrong with you? You're nauseous. Okay, we can deal with that. Swap to disease. Brother Angelica can have a sleep. You tend to do stuff, but I don't know what yet. Blue word. Blue word. Six. Okay, I've more efficient cooking now. Let's stick one wood on the fire. Dog. All right, as you are, continue to rest. You're being chaotic. <laughs> you rocks up, demand and stuff, getting me in trouble. <laughs> uh, Kari, off you go. So I'm gonna need you. Not be in the tavern, but you're also super tired. You're not, 
<laughs> you don't do any of those things. Uh... Okay, well, we don't need wood all stone right now. Well, we always do, but... Let's focus over here. What do I need to make in the forge? Well, I need to make a bunch of ropes. To make a bunch of ropes, I need a bunch of hemp. I'm growing some hemp. Um, ooh. I have enough wood to make some traps. Ah, but I need the ropes. I already want the traps. Let's do it. Okay. But that gives us the use for the herbalist, which is not to focus on healing plants, which is to focus on hemp, but actually no focus because I also need medicinal herbs. I mean, that's a deal for Mora, but Mora has <laughs> it's the most well rested. Um, your harvesting is like, okay, harvesting isn't super exhausting. So you need the best harvester. Ooh, are you done away, actually? You can, like, get some fruits. Like, calmly. Calmly get some fruits, please. <laughs> and you can carry on working on those pillows. <laughs> Or could you carefully work on some traps? <laughs> Very carefully. <laughs> Very gently. Okay, don't get too exhausted. Okay, you know what? Actually, I'm going to give people some cola seeds because I'm scared. I'm not ready for another person to die of fatigue. There we go. Let's make it less scary for them. And Iric's like chilling. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I've already lost one! <laughs> I won't lose any more just to fatigue. Alright, she's handling it. Have a nice little sleep. Nearly made some pillows. These traps don't take too long to make, but it'll be handy. They'll, they'll last us a bit, hopefully. <laughs> oh, they'll take longer to make than I expected. <laughs> Sonora isn't great at crafting, though. First it. Tasty. Tasty. Ah, one crap meal. <laughs> You've been doing so well lately, Pluderwed. Nope, you didn't find any medicinal herbs. <laughs> I think. I don't think I saw any flash up. Ah, so close. But no encounter. Not the worst. Uh, how much fire are we going to lose? And what do I need to fix? This. We are going to lose up to 30 fire. Make some water. We've got eight people. Shall we always stay over 40 fire? Is it 40 or 30? Okay, there we go. <laughs> A water and it's over 40. Good. Alright, they are ready to sleep. <laughs> Amazing. Uh, uh. So, welcome to our camp. What's your name again? I didn't tell you. Why bother remembering her name? She'll be dead soon anyway. Ah! Don't push poor old Gudrun in the tomb yet, baby girl. I've outlived many girls and boys of your age. <laughs> Not buds. Gudrun it is then. What? <laughs> That's your name, right? nice she's old <laughs> you must have had a very tiresome journey please make yourself at home Urgh. you call that home oh well child you have really low expectations but i should have known looking at who you're married to 
Mm -hmm. Shh, let her talk. She lost her mind, poor woman. She is starting to make more and more sense to me. <laughs> Look at that, buds. Wisdom buds. I know of the horn of High Mill hidden under the high reaching holy tree. On it there pours from Hel Belfather's pledge a mighty stream. Would you yet know more? <laughs> what was that? Huh? That thing you said. Uh, never mind. Will it now, Granny? Understand? No need to shout, you're wasting precious energy, child. So, when do we eat here? You want to make poor old Gudrun starve? There you go. She's good. Your secrets, I feel like. Can I help you, Lady Bluehead? Hmm, could you carry this pile of stuff here and bring it to the shelter? Right away. And up. Uh, I'll help you cook if you want. Oh, don't worry. I put in order the kitchen today. If you don't find something, ask me. About the same age, but you're so different from my Kari. It's scary. I didn't realize this guy was like a kid. I <laughs> I thought he looked like an adult, but he is he is child size. When you see him sitting down, he is he's about Kari sized. Is it bad? Which <laughs> I assume is how you tell people's ages in this. How how long are they? No. Not at all. I'd love to have a daughter like you. Oh, oh, didn't mean to. <laughs> Aha, no worries, Lady Bluehead. I understood what you meant. I'm not very strong like your husband, nor adventurous like your daughter. But it's good. I'm glad to have some help at the camp. Everyone can help in his own way, be it man or woman. I'll help however I can. I'm so grateful to you to let me join your camp. I feel humbled by your hospitality. I get their butts. Their butts. He seems like a good boy. <laughs> there you go, see? Smaller. Smaller than the adults. <laughs> okay, we've got five five dry. There you go. Yeah, I'm gonna have some water too. We can all hydrate together. <laughs> Part of the team. <laughs> yeah, he is smaller. <laughs> it's the only way to know someone's age. Size. Eat. I thought he was a, a shorter dude, but nope. Child. <laughs> okay, there we go. Most people had something to eat. Put away, you can have this. <laughs> Enjoy. I know you cooked on the meals. Enjoy your raw fruit. <laughs> oh yeah, then she, she takes her takes her drugs. Feels better. <laughs> In almost all ways. As, you know, most drug addicts do. <laughs> That's what I hear. <laughs> It makes you feel better in all senses. <laughs> yeah, black eye healed. He's hung over. Oh, this is everyone else got you hung over? Nah, it's nauseous. Red from coughing. Ah, but <laughs> headache. Illness progressing. Ah, we need to put the, the carrier's doggy back, buff back on as well. It will try to remember that for more than two seconds. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Rain. <laughs> Every day I'm like, please, the rain, I'm ready for it. Okay. Oh, we need wood. No, oh, it's okay because we just fixed the lumber camp. So we're we ready to, to get some wood. Uh, this one. How hungry are you? Get back up to 20. There you go. You get your buffs at 20. Okay, we better start gathering the water again. Garden. Hey, it's ready for harvesting. Uh, that will probably be your job. I, was, <laughs> I looked at this and was like, that's a fishing rod. <laughs> and I was like, but the fishing camp isn't normally there. They swap with the hunting camp. <laughs> I looked at this and was like, that's a fishing rod. <laughs> Just looked at that bow like, yeah, I know what that is. 
So dumb. <laughs> uh, okay, what do we need? We need... Mm, Arik, how are you doing? Why don't you get us some fish? How does that strike you? Um, who needs some healing? Everyone all the time? Forever? Yeah. Who had a headache? You. And a chronic Oh, that's right. The chronic diseases were spreading. Oops. I don't know where I put you. Yeah. Do it. Uh, fix a chronic disease, please. You can just do that, right? It's, it's that easy. Rub a herb on her. That's uh, That'll fix it, yeah? You can get your rest. Um. Carry on working on those pillows, that's fine. Who do I have left? Anyone? Or is everyone doing something? Hmm, everyone's doing something, which is actually an issue. Because I need some wood. So, you know what? Our water supplies are fine. Be the way to get some wood. Just a little. It's enough to fix our hunting camp, really. Harry's doggy, that's what I need to remember, and you're already doing that. Okay. I was just like, there's something. There's something I told myself to remember for more than one second. <laughs> okay, we're out of healing plants, so we've got to do something about that next time. Hey, the current disease is fixed. <laughs> it was that easy. Just rub a herb on it. <laughs> Sorted. <laughs> Energize. Good, you're learning. Those pillows are nearly done. Oof. Good to get Eric back on the crafting. There okay, we have gathered our hemp. Mm, the hemp took quite a long time to grow. It might be worth planting more just because our goal is rope. Oh, the vegetables are really handy. Why are you bored? You love fishing. Or wood. We'd like let our wood like restore because the, the natural resource is a little bit um, gone because we went so hard at the, the lumber camp because you need wood for everything. <laughs> oh, Arf. drink this. Your face is ugly when you're sick like that. It annoys me, now it's you. Good. That's handy. Uh, fix that. Fix that. Oh, why is everything breaking? Fix that. Why is everything in wood? <laughs> Up here. A long dead warrior. Well, he looks pretty cool. <laughs> I like this. Uh, an armoured corpse with an orn... Ornamented helmet is sitting against the old sun for what probably was once a tall tree. The warrior is long dead and the tree is chilling. The tree seems to have been cut down with great force, but only the stump remains. The ultimate chill, the forever chill. In the hand of the corpse hangs a tarnished pendant with an engraved symbol. A rune, no doubt. <laughs> Everything's a rune these days. Examine the pendant with our wisdom. We have the most wise person now. As you take a closer look at the pendant, you feel observed. A quick glance tells you there's nobody around and yet. <laughs> you like that? <laughs> this is definitely a rune and a mighty one. You can feel its energy radiating and you know this isn't a power to trifle with. Remember? He knows. He knows these runes. He knows what's up. It's Algis. The mark of protection and the highest... Is it Algis or Algis? I think it's Algis. The higher self. The rune of the divine linked to the realms of the gods. It is his courage in the face of fear. Even wiser. Hey, you can go over a hundred. <laughs> well, I mean, that sounds rad. <laughs> we should have that. Um, strength. <laughs> Be brave. You really take the pen. I can't help but notice the skeleton's hand. It closes at the same rate as you approach yours. Hmm. Pull the pendant. Yeah. I'm scared. Is there in disbelief that the skeletal hand that mirrors yours? Are you losing your mind? You hesitate. You should, the dead should stay dead. Made him sad. Alright, let's remove the helmet then. That might be the condition that I haven't met. Uh, highest agility. Good luck. <laughs> As you reach for the helmet, you notice many sharp looking spikes protruding from its surface. It'll be difficult to grab without hurting your hands. Well, do your best. No, it was difficult, but you did it. <laughs> you managed to slip your fingers right in between the spikes and start pulling. 
However, you quickly notice that your efforts are useless. It's as if you are trying to remove a part of the statue. And yet, while holding the head of the dead warrior between your hands, you feel a brief moment of intense communion. It's just a glimpse of a presence far greater than what your mind can conceive, but you have a hunch that someone or something is watching you. Oh, but you like that. Hey. Oh, it's like a like a godly feeling, okay. <laughs> not like not like a stalker. <laughs> like that. Uh, higher presence, okay. Oh, uh, Tomoy is courageous. Let's give her a go. Alright, pull the pendant. Uh, you grab the pendant and pull it towards you, but the corpse holds it tightly. His hand is firmly wrapped around the string. It seems too solid to break. <laughs> Kick it. You kick the corpse as hard as you can, but before you can hit it, the other hand grabs your ankle. Oh no! <laughs> You're in an awkward position, not to mention the fact that the corpse did not let go of your ankle. Uh, let's just hang out. <laughs> you wait. You wait for so long that you start to get hungry, yet the skeleton shows no sign of fatigue. I mean, that's fair. He's, I understand that he wouldn't show any signs of fatigue. Keep waiting. <laughs> okay, nice. After what seems to be an eternity, the corpse finally releases both the pen and your ankle. Hey, he waited it out. <laughs> when you lift the pen to examine it closer, it crumbles between your fingers and turns to ashes. Something feels different, as if the impervious power you felt before had vanished. Dang it. Oh, but he's still here. We can remove the helmet now. Uh, it takes courage and strength. Well, let's go for courage first. It worked before. Okay, so you raise it upwards, use your muscles, which you don't have very many of, as it turns out. Yeah, you pull hard to no avail. If only you had good strength, a bit tired. Okay. Uh, whoops, I didn't mean to inspect. So you're gonna hang some girls. I I thought I was gonna get a. Sweet necklace that made us strong and brave. <laughs> um, so it was how I just tried, so let's be strong. Let's use our muscles. No, even you only have a 56% chance. Mm. Everyone's so weak and tired now. <laughs> ah, so inspecting. <laughs> Who else is reasonably strong? Shinor's pretty strong. Also a bit tired. Now let's have Eric rest. We'll come back. Eric's the strongest. Like no one's stronger than him. But he needs he needs a little rest. I want him to do some crafting, but he needs he needs to rest now. Um, but he can't do any healing right now. So we need people to have different jobs. This is our second half of the day, so we need to do some cooking. I didn't mean to click that. Uh, cook up eight fishes. I'll take 48 fire. At maximum. We do need some more fire. Dog. Dog. I can't click anything, right? Um, I do need something to work in the garden to get it ready for the next planting. We need some wood. I don't know why you're standing at the fishing. But we need we need a little bit of wood. We also need some herbs. Are you in charge of those? We're crafting. Oh, Shinor's still around. I'm gonna have Shinor do. I'm gonna have Shinor do the other crafting. Not very good at crafting, but she can. Actually, I should swap these because this one's nearly done. Oh, actually, she's better at crafting than Moira. Since when? <laughs> is, she, is it because of the chronic disease? Because of the hangover? I uh, no. That's a surprise. Okay. You're resting, you're doing that, you're cooking. Mm, maybe I should swap you two. Uh, you're, you're both better at these things. I was worried about his tiredness. Hopefully, toiling the garden isn't um, toiling. To toiling. The garden isn't as uh, tiring as mining. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay. Everyone's doing something. Get to it. Rest up. Get your muscles back, Eric. Okay. Pillow completed. 
They'll all get a little bit more sleep. I love sleeping. <laughs> I love sleeping in the mornings. That's my favourite time to sleep. How about you? What's, what's your favourite time to sleep? I sleep so much better, like, in the mornings, just before my alarm, than I do the rest of the night. Just before or just after the alarm, those are the, the most restful five and ten minutes of sleep. <laughs> I can have entire dreams in that time. dream I had this morning. I remember having some sort of dream. That was like a bunch of stuff happening but I've, lo I've lost it. Forgotten. I think I dream quite frequently. I have a lot of dreams. place and no encounter uh, what's that? I think yeah dream but you can't remember it yet <laughs> it's, I usually remember it really well when I wake up and then like yeah <laughs> it will fade hard I used to try and tell someone <laughs> in the morning or like as soon as I can while I still have it in my head so I can uh, have a better chance at like if I can remember the conversation I had I can remember the dream <laughs> Don't want to fetch a hemp. The gods be blessed with this plant. You'll be able to craft ropes, fabric, healing styles, painkillers, and divination incense. That's a great asset for the camp. Examine the soil. Our best gardener. The practice which is small areas, but no hemp elsewhere. Something in the soil must have helped it grow. Dig. Uh, you put some of the fertile soil in the practice using your own crops hidden in the dirt, you find a little Chinese stone. Hey! Useful things. And seeds. I like that everyone dreams really, really differently. So like, my dreams uh, I usually either a very like third person sort of deal, like I'm not there at all and I'm just like watching a story play out. Um, as usually if I have like video game dreams and <laughs> playing something too long, I'll like dream about the video game characters, but I won't be there. I'll just be watching them. Um, but when I <laughs> when I dream more more normally uh, with me in there, I I can't do architecture like at all. <laughs> I think it comes down to my really really bad sense of direction in in real life. <laughs> so all my buildings are just like nonsense. <laughs> <laughs> They're like they just make absolutely no sense. It's amazing. Uh, let's have you gather some. <laughs> A variety of hard hemp is probably suited for crafting resin fabric and ropes. But some people dream like they dream it. They know all the places they've been and like it's all like real places and they they know exactly where they were and where they went. And so I'm just like, nope. I turned the corner and then I was in a really big shop and then it had no roof and then I took a lift upstairs and then I was in a castle. <laughs> like, it's all very much like that. Every corner is just like a new environment. <laughs> Although you know, you can also gather a few things for healing divination purposes. It might be less potent than other hemp types. Um, yeah, get some healing stuff. We're out of healing herbs. Healing herbs? Healing herbs. Medicinal herbs. <laughs> The plants, the plants with the best healing properties of flowers and the whitest leaves. Hey, five healing plants. That's pretty sweet. And healing dust. What the heck's healing dust? Healing plus five. Nice. That should go on you. Pow. Who needs the luck stone? It's scavenging. That should be... Our blue words are already maxed out. So next is... Um, Curry. And then gardening, that's Brother Angelico. Good stuff. Okay. Let's harvest some more. Did you? Oh, who has good crafting? Eric. Let's see if Eric can get some of the, the crafting ones. I assume this is going to be hemp. This one. <laughs> 
I've before cutting anything, you look for seeds. If you can find them that camp, it will significantly improve the quality of life. Then you take out your knife and begin flimsy cutting and removing all these from the stalks. Uh, that will make you save time to get the fibers out of the stalks to camp. He's going for it. There we go, got some hemp. I probably need to get hemp again. Just because of our tribute. But the healing dust is very handy. A little bit tired. Better harvester. And some more hemp. There we go, we like that. I heard dreams be a chase, not being able to scream in face of people so you can remember. Those don't sound like the fun dreams at all. <laughs> Those sound like the bad ones. <laughs> uh, dreams, dreams are always interesting, even when the nightmares, I think. Though the nightmares are not as fun. What was my last nightmare? Oh, beside the ones that don't make any sense. I remember being really bothered by a nightmare. I had a little, a little while ago the other day. I think I tweeted when I, the day because it was a, a night where I got like no sleep and because it was really windy. And then, I, like all the bins and gun and stuff were being knocked around, I could hear it all night. And then when I fell asleep, I had a nightmare. I was really annoyed because I was freaking exhausted all day. <laughs> but uh, that was like, I was in like a basement house and there were. That's right, there was like a ring cam installed and some sliding doors and I was watching the ring cam and was like laughing that the people were running out because they were being chased by like the man that offers you bin bags that just is outside the house, that's outside the block, which was apparently just a thing. Then like a guy walked up to them with a shotgun and just like shot the heck out of this guy and then I was like, oh no, he's coming for me next. I was very scared that he was going to come to my door so I ran away. And then ran into a forest and then pretended to be a zombie and <laughs> started so crawling through the forest. And then realised while I was crawling through the forest, they're like, oh, this isn't a good place to hide from a man with a shotgun. This is terrifying. <laughs> like, I shouldn't be here. This is I'm very scared. <laughs> and like headed back. <laughs> and then was worried about getting back in. <laughs> it's like, why was I, I woke up like, why was I going back? <laughs> what was my plan? <laughs> why were all these ideas terrible? <laughs> <laughs> that was my last one. I didn't like it. <laughs> Quite interesting dream. Thank you. <laughs> Imaginative. Uh, minus 30 fire. I need to keep at least 30 fire. <laughs> Take as much water as I can while keeping over 30 fire. Alright, that's the most water we can have. <laughs> yeah, I like a good dream. <laughs> Working all day long in these conditions. That's so hard. That's what she said. And I'm so hungry. I just want to put something in my mouth. Anything. And that's what she said. And I dreamed that we had so much water that I could shower my face with the precious juice. That's what she said. Not proud of that one. And when I see how Bjorn is taking all we have, I just want to shoot my arrow in his big fat butt. That's what he said. Why are you smiling? You're mocking me again. What are you talking about? <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Where is based? <laughs> Where knows what's up? <laughs> uh, we need seven water. Whoops. Give that back. Everyone can have that much. Good luck. You all have 75% chance to deal with your dehydration. Good luck, everyone. Oh my god. 75% chance. were my favourite, they did all fail it. <laughs> Mad. None of you should be as thirsty as you are. 
<laughs> That's what I get for the rolling two seventy percent chances earlier. <laughs> uh, I'm just hungry. You. <laughs> hey, you all. <laughs> I'll try where you all. I hope it rains. <laughs> Mad. Have you guys seen uh, the the cat with the the buttons? <laughs> mad, mad, mad. That's me right now. <laughs> mad. <laughs> Oops. Oh, we lost one meat. It's fine. Rain. Num num. Uh, do we have battle dog on still? That's broken. Oh, well, we don't need some stone. And it's wood. Yeah, okay. Take that. Um, this is the button. What was I looking for? Dog. That's what I was looking at. Bat uh, battle dog, that was it. <laughs> Came back in, in pieces. Start that for two days, cool. Oh, uh, yeah, you can save up, forget it. Alright, more at. Well, actually, you're injured. I don't know when that happened. <laughs> um, this is your, your back pain, I guess? Got you. Alright, let's uh, deal with that. You need to heal your wounds. Resting. Do I need to rest? No one needs to rest particularly. Need a crafting plan. I um, might hold off on the crafting plan to be honest and work on the forge. Who do I have? Um, oh, nothing a bit here. Let's get Iric crafting. He's my best crafter. Let's get him to get those traps done. Harry will go out. We have enough water. Uh, you do some mining. We need... Oh, hey, we can plant stuff. Night. You no, know let's just plant more hemp. And then you don't need to do anything in the garden. More is a better harvester. What can I have you do, Angelico? You can't do anything particularly physical. Where did Blue go? Oh, he ain't done, right. So that means Shinor will do that because she's our next best gatherer. No! Kari's our next best scavenger. Yeah, Kari's way better. Yeah, Shinor, you can go out and explore. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine. Um, I'm kind of have people left over, so if that's something I can build, I guess I may as well. Boiling water consumes us fire. That is useful. Mm, don't really care about that. What's this one? Better fit. Oh, that's just 20 seeds. That's crazy. Oh, see, I don't want to use up ropes. That's also something to consider. So, yeah, let's do that water upgrade. There you go. That gives Brother Angelica something to look at. In the meantime, is everyone doing something? I need someone to get the other wood. Well, it's like Brother Angelica might be uh, in charge of crafting. And that's Moira. You'll be mad about it. <laughs> you can only get two to three. 
Okay, well, alright, guts. Three to six. Okay, yeah. It's you. Okay, Mora's better crafter. There you go. No, wait, Mora was gathering. Yeah, but we should craft. But we don't need to craft both things at the same time. So we'll put Brother Angelica there. There we go, okay. I think we've worked everyone round. <laughs> Everyone's doing something. <laughs> Mora craft. <laughs> There we go. Hey, okay, everyone's doing something I need. <laughs> I got tangled. <laughs> there you go, everyone's being useful. Hey, back no more back pain. <laughs> Rubber herb on it. <laughs> I'm sure they probably make some sort of tea out of the medicinal herb, like a paste or something, but I like to think they just they just rub the leaf directly on the injury. <laughs> this will this will help. Oh we're going achievement survivalist. Getting someone to level 15. Oh, you got quite a lot of water. Yeah, nice. <laughs> oh, good job. Some good hemp and some good seeds. He's proud. Agile. A little bit of target. Who isn't? <laughs> okay, he's having kind of a sad time, but I mean, I'm not sure anyone else is. How to check everyone's depression? You don't have that long to make that many ropes. <laughs> Figure out how long it's taking us to make fire traps. Okay, at least you didn't find an encounter, so you didn't go very far. That was what you need to fix. The forge. Mm, mining camp. Okay, there we go. Everything's fixed again. No depression affects it. I think I'll find out. <laughs> there we go. My, uh, so it gives it a minus to all mental skills. Ah, intelligence, courage, charisma, and wisdom, which has an effect on intelligence, base action, all skills, XP gains, uh, courage, base action, uh, rushing, decrease when you need a tavern. Eating temp, fishing camp. There you go. It affects a lot of XP gain. Yeah, it's kind of good to see because you'd be like, oh, well, it doesn't really matter if, if you're kind of sad because that doesn't really affect anything I do with you. But it has, yeah, quite a lot of um, knock on for XP. We don't have enough biz. Can I make more biz? There you go. Second beer created. Enjoy. Oh, where I leveled up. What have you got? Don't care about combat, experience healer. Maybe. Ah. Constitution. Constitution isn't very high. Plus, hunger recovery could be good. Use your healing. I like having healing. Experience because you do it sometimes. You don't do it as much right now. That's yeah, gonna be the fast hunger recovery. It's fine. And the fatigue plays do the same but physical. Uh... Oh, you get a minus to all skills. But fatigue. That's pretty that's pretty intense. <laughs> yeah, minus all. <laughs> I mean, that's how I feel when I'm tired, so I guess that makes sense. Oh, actually, no, I need Blue to Wed because she is my cook. Um, I could have. No, I didn't get any food earlier. <laughs> oh, do I have any areas of food? I didn't really think about food. Which is a rarity, I am often thinking about food. Older there.
Have a little look around. What have I, what have I got that I can look at? Oh, there's salt. I don't care about salt. I'm more excited about powder. <laughs> like, if I go hang out with you, can you give me any more information about anything? Uh, Sally still haven't found his daughter. Okay. He's still looking for his daughter, confirmed. <laughs> Whoops. Maybe this horse could help me. I wonder if I can interact with any of these things that I've had, like, sitting for ages. Mm. Harry's close to having good rolls everywhere, except for that wisdom. I think he'd pass all of them. Give it a go, but I think the leopard might attack her. Have a go. Have a go at approaching. Those cats are scary. You try to hail the woman from a safe, far enough position, but she doesn't seem to notice you. In fact, she doesn't seem to be moving at all. You wonder if she's e uh, she's not asleep. There's no beating around the bush. You want to take her out. You'll have to get past these monstrous felines. Advance with confidence. Okay. Take a few comfortable steps towards the throne and the annoying cats. Before them freeze and instantly start hissing at you. You're at pause to reach, but weirdly they don't make any move towards you. You come safely close to the throne and can check out the blue woman in detail. She is not sleeping. She's in some sort of trance. Her blank eyes staring into the void. Search the throne. Okay. You search around the throne of the lady in blue, not too close to her. And you find something. A large flat stone like many other others, but someone carved runes into one of the sites. Okay, makes you feel good. Makes you a better scavenger. Alright, nice. You put the stone in your purse and move away. Once back to the camp, the others will want to have a look at it. Maybe you can manage to read those runes. Some secret of the mysterious lady will be listed. Oh, ancient knowledge. Nice. for a clue. Oh, I found a clue. Wait for the night. <laughs> okay, nice. We did something. What else can I look at? What was this? Ah, special relax water. <laughs> relax water? Uh, you know what? Let's, we've achieved one thing. Let's hope for the night. <laughs> Maybe it'll help us with the scary gate. <laughs> uh, get a special item. Uh, but yeah, we. <laughs> that's right, food. We have two food. I'm pretty sure you're a decent cook, so. Go for it. Oh, well, she got 28 cooking. It's not great, but. You only have two things to cook, so I guess it's fine. <laughs> Um, I probably don't care about getting more water, so you can go explore, use some more wood, what do we need? Okay, you're crafting there. gather some wood. No, you're not gonna like it. Who's better? Okay, you're, you're a bit better there. How do you only get one stone? You don't even get one, to, like zero to two, you get zero to one. Terrible. He's gonna be pretty tired. But that's life. I'm afraid. Okay, they get to chill out, have some drinks, live it up. Oh, do I love that? Got rid of all of her depression. She's psyched. They're taking forever to make these traps. <laughs> Oh, oh, we had two meat. That's right. <laughs> Perfect. What do you find? A hey, for him. Find only one seed. Oh, 
I doing feel better being like the only monk now? He is tired. You might have a cola nut <laughs> before we go to bed. <laughs> One day I'll make potions. <laughs> One day. Good luck, Carrie. We've explored a beach. Most of a meadow. Well, not most. Less than most. Dang, encounter. I was hoping to get lucky. Um. Who's in a good place to fight? Shinor's fine. Food really is nice to have because of the amount of health she has. Her initiative's also up right now. Cool. Yeah, I gave Ludo a buff, didn't I? Like, give it 3% crit or something? Did I give her that? Oh, you could hit everyone, like, straight off the bat. Oh, two crits right off the bat as well. Nice. Get your dodge on. Going straight in for some kills. Heck yeah. Oh, it was AP up, that was it. I think. Uh, Alright, it's your best on one. No, you don't have a very good chance of hitting anyone. I haven't done your accuracy. Why is your accuracy so low? I'll well, give it a go. Ha! Double crits, double crits. I gave him a debuff. Actually, there's no one in particular you need to, to buff. Let's go again. Ha! There we go. We took one down with the shield. Mum with the kill shot. <laughs> the screen man. Shield lady now. <laughs> yeah, the guy I had um, at my front line before is dead now. So <laughs> with the book. Unfortunately, he perished. Tired. Um, I did take out the drunkard. Even though he's like a little bit tankier, I think he um. He does the buffs. <laughs> Which will make this guy hard to take out. <laughs> Alright, he's got the triple fermented ale. But he is focused. <laughs> he's an enabler. He's giving other people ale while he focuses. Dodge. Take your AP through to next time. Okay. You, on the other hand, you. Oh wait, no. You might be able to pull him forward <laughs> by calling him names. Yeah, good job. Let's smack him a little bit more for zero damage. Nice. <laughs> exactly what I wanted. He's hard to work down, but <laughs> it's gotta be done. This buff is pretty big for the damage resistance. Two damage resistance is a lot. Okay, good. Good dodges. Good dodges. Good dodges. Dodges. <laughs> My tongue went in the way. <laughs> Too much of it. Too much tongue. Get him. Ah! <laughs> Get him again. Try harder. <laughs> but how? How can zero be a crit? <laughs> it's not your max damage. It drives me crazy. Why can't we do damage to this guy? <laughs> yeah, just as much chance as doing three damage as doing zero. <laughs> just as much chance. Oh my god. We've achieved not. We landed like three hits and achieved nothing. What the heck? <laughs> Infuriating. <laughs> the crits don't make a lot of sense to me because you so often crit for less than your max damage. So what does it mean to crit? <laughs> if it's not more damage, what does it mean? <laughs> If you can crit for zero when you have the chance of doing three damage, what does it mean? 
Down at him. Steps me forward, but it means he can t he can take more damage. There we go. Finally, the lever on the front line. That's fine. Um, I'll have you guard her. Oh, I, yeah, I didn't need you to guard her. She had a lot of dodge. No, she didn't have dodge. I didn't do the dodge. I didn't have the the space. There we go. Come back to me. <laughs> the thing I did two seconds ago. I can remember. Get your dodge up in case he throws an axe at you. I mean, she has the guard on, but she's taking injury already. <laughs> and Curry has some defense still. But at least he gives her the uh, damage resist. Should have actually done a hit and run. It's okay, I can still do hit and run. Just to move back. Yeah. Then, smack him. Yeah. Smack the heck out of him. He's nearly done. I can do it. Ha. Keep beating him up. Ha. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> He <laughs> got there. That was a tricky fight. But I only put him I took damage. Just to get it to his shoulder. But hey, we got a rope. <laughs> and spears! <laughs> and level. Uh, let's have... Oh, minimum damage up. That is really good. All of these are really good. But minimum damage up, I think, is very important. That sounds amazing. Fix the herbalist and fix the tavern. What do we find? Oops, that's the horse. That I think needs to be fed some meat. That is seaweed. Use for seaweed. Uh, the long. Um. I'm gonna come back to this area because I think I'll probably be able to get some food out of it. How much fire do I need? Thirty. Also, it's gonna give Lady Tomoe a cola nut to ensure that <laughs> she survives <laughs> long enough to sleep. Let's give me a fire at fifty. That shouldn't be an issue. Over 50? Over 40? Over 30? <laughs> Already forgotten what I read? Brain so smooth. So lizard. There you go, it's all there. There we go. So what do we have? Let's so hope people aren't too dry. Uh, everyone, listen please. We found a new inhabitant on the island. A strange blue sleeping naked oh I'm protected by four gigantic cats she sure stands out he found a little tablet near her throne covered in runes let me see it hmm hmm do you understand something from these runes Moira it's very old it looks like our runes but in a very archaic form Thankfully, I read a lot of old tablets back home while you were frolicking God knows where. So, what does it say? It seems to be some kind of words to awake a god, if I'm not mistaken. A spell? No, no, more of an incantation. <laughs> What's the difference? The formula is pretty simple. You shall dis- Declaim. Declaim. The words in front of the god you want to wake up. Raise the rest left hand and speak with your heart. Speak with your heart? How so? Is it a riddle? Uh, that's just a figure of speech. We, people of knowledge, use it a lot to impress the common folk. You just have to say the words loud and clear. Are the words written on the tablet? If you stop interrupting me, I would have said them already. Hear me, O Thor, fair lord of the glorious Acer, son of Odin. Wake from your eternal sleep and speak to me. 
That's all? Yes, that's all. Seems too easy. Fishy. Easy? Maybe not. The last time I checked under Thor's pants, he had two big walls. So she can't be him. And if we don't know the name of the god we want to awaken, the task seems impossible. We assume that she is a goddess. Of course, I thought he was going to say more than that. <laughs> I thought that was just the front of his sentence. Well, I'll just have to guess then. <laughs> just make up names for her. <laughs> Maybe she looks like a Susan. <laughs> Let's sleep on it tonight and check on her sometime soon. I really want to get to the bottom of this. It may be important. In this, the god that we found on the throne uh, in the area might be of some importance to us. Might be useful. Hey boy, I was wondering, what have you been up to now that you have met a true witch? Hmm? Who are you referring to? Her. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, yes, but I don't understand the meaning of your question. I thought that your people burnt witches on sight, isn't that right? Hmm, only when there is industry for proof. We are no barbaric people. <laughs> Just guess a name, so easy! <laughs> of course, of course, so you don't feel the urge to burn our good old Gudrun? No, I... that doesn't seem right. I can't judge myself and... no. Good to hear that. Still, I don't understand the rules of your god. I thought that killing a man or a woman was a sin that would send you directly to hell. So why would you keep on burning people? No, no. Witches have made a pact with the devil. Their souls are tainted. Killing a heretic is not forbidden by the law of god, even if... Even if I always struggle to understand this principle. For being a heretic, they, they are human beings, so their lives should be valued above all. It keeps saying an heretic, but that's not proper grammar. <laughs> ah, you're a priest and you don't even understand the laws of your so-called god? Poor nonsense. <laughs> not friends. <laughs> I... There is a lot to study in the scriptures, and some study them during a lifetime and still don't grasp everything. And now I'm sad. <laughs> yeah, yeah, your god seems to overcomplicate things a little too much. Alright. <laughs> they've all they've all talked about some things. Gods and well they all talked about gods, so I guess that's all in keeping. Oh god, they're so thirsty. Alright, everyone gets that much. And the people who are extra hydrated get a confirmed one. They don't get any worse. And you know what, Eric? I have chosen you. Yeah, 1.5 water. Nope, I have chosen you to get 1.25 water because I need 0.5 to go exploring. <laughs> there you go. Good luck. 25% chance of getting rid of your dehydrated 2 status. Hey, I'm finally getting some lucky rolls. <laughs> Hooray! Made up for last time. Girl doesn't quite seem to realize she fits into that witch category quite well. Oh, she knows. <laughs> she knows. <laughs> uh, who's hungriest? You? Uh, you? Okay, if anyone gets hungrier, we have uh, we have dried food. But if I just remember to send someone hunting, it would help. <laughs> They're all they're all doing their things. I like the ones that have some sort of like amusement that can like reduce their depression a little bit, like by themselves. They have some sort of built-in optimism. Oh, nice <laughs> chronic disease and irrationale. <laughs> but her sickness isn't even that high, <laughs> so it's not like a priority. <laughs> Probably feels more like a priority to her. She's not having a great time. <laughs> Hooray! Alright, time for me to head to bed. My throat is hurting a little bit. Stretch. I'm sure it doesn't sound much like uh, my voice is changing when I try to do my voice acting, but it feels like I'm doing more than it sounds. <laughs> uh, thank you for coming! Thank you for coming to my stream! I hope you enjoyed it. 
I always have fun playing this game. Getting closer and closer to me finally finishing a run of this. <laughs> one day, one day I'll find the rest of the uh <laughs> one day I'll find the rest of the plot. <laughs> it's so far away, I don't know where it is. One day I'll find it. I'm getting close to the god at least. Yes, I'll take care, don't worry. <laughs> I'll look after it. Oh, I'll get sick, one or the other. <laughs> Hopefully not. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully I just have a nice drink and it'll be fixed. <laughs> uh, I don't talk very much, like during the day exactly. I don't really go out, so <laughs> streaming is uh, some good exercise for it. <laughs> yes, thanks for coming. I've had a great time. My next stream will be on Thursday at the same time as this one, eight sorry, eight p.m. GMT, and it will be Guitar Man. <laughs> so I we. Trying to trying to get onto Master's Play on that. So I'm trying to hone some skills, get my thumb abs spilled up again. My thumbs become so weak. <laughs> I hope you have a great rest of your night. Good night, everyone. Good night. Have a good sleep. Or rest of your day. <laughs> Whatever it is. <laughs> good night. Bye bye.